and good morning good afternoon maybe your time is different from us so here is in the morning your 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 time there could be the afternoon it's all about jesus time and season is all about jesus we thank god for each and everyone thank you thank you sister thank you brother thank you for coming god bless you so uh this is your host once again uh, prophetess dr christine Ziggy, welcome you from overcomers deliverance and healing ministry overcomers deliverance and healing ministry is based on spiritual warfare and i want to thank god for what he's doing around the world i get test a lot of testimony and uh, de deliverance many people who are reviewing my videos they they have they have been delivered they have got their healing they have received their miracle I got a testimony upon testimony. People are texting me, writing to me, appreciate that God is doing something. So God is doing this, um, our ministry God is using to bless people and deliver them in Jesus' name. It's all about Jesus. Therefore, people of God, as, a, as, a, as, a, as, a, as I'm going to talk to you, the subject called aggressive prayer against charms and charmers witchcraft. Aggressive prayer against charmers charms and witchcraft now we are going to look from the book of acts 8 verse 9 to 13 the book of acts 8 verse 9 to 13 the bible says but there was a man named simeon who but there was a man named simon who who had pre previously practiced magic in the city and amused the people of Samaria, saying that he himself was somebody great. They all paid attention to him from the rest to the, from the, rest to the greatest, saying, this man is the power of God that is called great, and they pay attention to him. Because for a long time he had amused them with his magic, but when they believe, believed Philip as he preached good news about the kingdom of God and the name of Jesus Christ, they were baptized both men and women. Even Simon himself believed, and after being baptized, he continued with Philip, and seeing signs and great miracles performed, he was amused. Here is a man in Samaria who was using charms, charms and charmers in, in, in the city. Charms and charmers. He was witching people. People that were not aware what this man was doing to them. The people believed that this man is a great man. Is a, is a great man of God. They were calling him a great man of God. He is a, a great man of God. And he was a witch. He was a wizard. He was doing, he was practice with uh, charms and charmers. He, he, he fooled the people of Samaria. People of Samaria was fooled, was, was witched by this man for a long time. And the people were paying attention to him. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. These are a lot of rights. Let me turn this, some of the rights off. Yes. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. God is good. Now, this man, he was a, a charmer. He was using charms and charmers. And he made the old city of, of, of Samaria. And the people believed him. They call him that a great man of God. He was a great man from God. They said that this man, this man is the powerful, his power. This man is the power of God. That is called great. They call him that the man was using the power of God called great. And this man, for sure, he was he was not using any any power of God, but he was using witchcraft and 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 charms. The man continued witching the people of Samaria, and some the people of Samaria, all of them believed in him. They believed him because of what he was doing, the miracles things he was doing. People they believed him, and nobody detected him that he was a witch. Until Philip 
went there and deprogram his power. And Tiri Philip went there and destroyed the power. And they command the powers of charms and, and the charms to be de roasted, become homeless, become powerless. That's when uh, this uh, Zamon was not able to operate again in Samaria. Therefore, people of God, any witches that have been traveling your village, traveling your family, you have the authority to stand against them and rebuke them and destroy them in the mighty name of Jesus. You command their charmers to turn against themselves and destroy themselves in the mighty name of Jesus. You command their charmers, their witches, their spells to turn their to turn to turn to themselves and destroy themselves. Deprogram their powers. Command their powers to lose their direction and their and, and their ways in Jesus' name. Now Philip, Philip understood that there is a powerful witchcraft in the city, but he did not fear. He went and preached Jesus Christ, the Son of the Living God, and the people believed, in including him. When he found that he was not able to operate, his power was powerless. So he went to Philip, and they believed, and he was saved. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, you have the powers to stop those witches and wizards that are troubling you all the time. They are attacking you. Stand firm. Pray aggressive prayers. Deprogram their, their charmers. Deprogram their, their prayers. Stand and rebuke them because they are charms. Now, when you see this man was called a, a powerful, a great man from God, the whole city, they feared him. They, and the man was there and everybody could not say any word until philip philip went there the disciples of jesus and the programs his charmers and the, and the, and the make his power of, of which can powerless in the mighty name of jesus in the name of jesus i command the charmers and and the wizard and spells in you to disappear would disappear let it disappear with it with it there or with it there with it there, there with it there all loots let them disappear let them be removed let them be landed powerless in jesus name every spells charmers that has been spells on you that you cannot function you cannot think properly let it be destroyed by fire in jesus name do you know some people they are living with spells they some people they spell on them when they are spells, they can't think properly. They, their head is gone. They cannot operate by themselves. They are operated by the by the, the by the by the by the the person who charms them or spells on them. They are the victim of of these spells. Now, if it is a woman, the husband can do the, this woman anything he wants. He can abuse him, beating him, abusing him, and and taking everything from her. If she's working, she become a total slave. All her money, everything. If he has wealthy, this person will take them everything from from her. If it is a man, the woman has used spells and charms. The man become useless. He will sell everything and give to this woman. And this is what many uh, 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 women, many women, they used to men. Men who go to them and these men they get lost completely. They don't know their family. They, 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 they such a men they hate their family, including their children. They don't want to see even if you do anything. Even they don't want to see their wives and their children. They deny them. They refuse them because of these charms. But we have to tell them. We command you demonic powers assigned assigned to the charmers to the charmers. I lend you homeless. I lend you powerless. I lend you useless. You lose your direction and you lose your ways in Jesus' name. You command them. You command you spells. You command you charmers of witchcraft. You witchcraft charmers. You witchcraft spells. I am now speaking to you by the power in the blood of Jesus. I nullify you. I destroy you. I curse you. Come out. Come out from my life. Come out from my child. Come out from my, my family in Jesus' name. Because you might find your, your, your sons is being lost. It's been in the under influence of charmer, charms and, and spells and witchcraft that this your son does not know anybody in the family. 
and is taking all of the money to the woman, the woman maybe has, who has charmed them, who has passed on them. So you have to stand against to pray for our family. You have to stand against with the aggressive prayers. I am sympathized. I pray sometimes. I, I said a, 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 a woman who is crying in the house that the husband, the husband has been taken by another woman, another woman. Or a, or a man crying tears. People calls me here with the tears that the, a wife has been taken with somebody's wife, with some, a man with somebody's. A, a woman has, has, has been taken somebody's husband. So all these things is charms and charmer spells. They have been sent to them. Now this man abandoned them. I pray by the power in the blood of Jesus. Let their charmers be destroyed and be rendered powerless in Jesus' name. Anyone being attacked, being affected with the charms and charmers, spells, witchcraft, I command the fire of God to consume them and burn them to ashes in Jesus' name. Oh yes, Lord. You command charmers to receive, to receive, uh, to receive, to, to receive triangle attacks and be destroyed and be rendered powerless in Jesus' name. Triangle attack. Let the charmers and charms and spells witchcraft receive triangle attacks and be destroyed and be rendered powerless in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. I thank God. Let's look in the, another scripture. The book of uh, the book of uh, the book of Acts 19, verse, verse 19. The Bible says, and the men of those that practice curious acts brought their books on charmers and burned them before all. Yes, when the when the people of Samaria, the Bible says when when Paul was preaching, here is now Paul was preaching. Paul has to preach very aggressive prayers until the charmers were no more to operate. Until the charmers they did not have any power to operate. So they had to, 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 to throw them away. They have to bring them and burn them. They, because there's some people, there's some witchcraft that are using books. They are using books to read. Now they read on you. If they read on you, you will go. You will die. Because they are, they are, they are, they are, they are practicing with charmers and witchcraft. They read on you. It is a, it's a very serious book. And it catches their victim very easily. Because you believe on them. These books, they are very dangerous. And there's a lot of books they are using. Because the Bible says, you will see some people, they even write so, 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 some things. And they give you to, to use it and work with it. You put on your pass or you put on your body. You put on your neck so that this, these charms can work on you. I'm telling you, these are magic and useless. They have no power. They have no power. They have charms. They have no power. Look at what happened. After the people received the gospel of Jesus Christ, they, they noticed that this, their books, their charms is no longer power. They have no power. They have, they have nothing. So they had to give them to burn them to ashes. Let charmers and, and, and charms and, and spells programmed in your life, in your body, catch fire and burn to ashes in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Charmers, charmers are there and they are really. Witchcraft are there and they are really. Therefore, people of God, we have to stand and pray against them. We have to stop them, whether the devil like it or not. Every spells, charms, and the evil that has been spells on you, that has spells on your work, that has spells on the on, on the work of your hand, let them catch fire and burn to ashes. I am telling you, people that are ignorant, and the ignorant people they continue suffering. They 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 may say this they don't like this prayer of deliverance, and they are the prayer they need. And many people are suffering and and die because of ignorance. This is the truth. It is biblical. Look at this. They were practice. They were practice charms and they are, they burn their, their their books and all of them they, they burn them. In the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord, I thank you, God. I bleed the blood of Jesus. Now let's look on another scripture. The Bible says, Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. You come. The Bible says, Deuteronomy eighteen verse nine to twelve. The Bible says. When you come unto the land that the Lord your God is giving you, you shall not learn to follow abomination practice of those nations. Therefore, there shall not find among you anyone who burn his sons or his daughters as an offering 
Anyone, anyone who practice who practices divina, divination or telephone voting or interplates omens or sorcerers or jama or medium or nicomers, one who inquires of the dead of of whoever does these things is an abomination to the Lord, and because of this abomination, the Lord your God is driving them out before you. You know, here we are picking the word chamas. You should not find anybody using chamas in, in your midst. Any witchcraft using charms, spells, witchcraft, incarnation, raining incarnation on you. The Bible says they should not be found among them, among your community, among your family, because the Bible has said, therefore, you command their chamas and their charms to receive, to receive the, the hailstone of God and burn to ashes. In the mighty name of Jesus, you you deprogram, you 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 command them. I deprogram you, charmers and charms. I cancel you. I cancel your 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 function. You will not function. You I have destroyed you. I burn you. I curse you. I render you powerless. You command them. You charmers, dig your own grave, fall unto it, and bury yourself in Jesus' name. You command you spells. You you hold them because everything has ears. Because here in your community, in your house, you find at workplace, you, you see this, there is witchcraft, there is charmers, there is spells, there is witchcraft operating in, the, in a place of work or your environment, wherever they are. You call upon those witchcraft, command them to, rip, to dig their, grave, their own grave and enter into, the, into it. Command them to lose their powers. Take the authority, pray a very aggressive prayer against them. They will not function. When Philip noticed that there is a witch here, what did Philip do? Philip ran a prayer, ran, ran, ran a prayer, powerful prayer, aggressive prayer against the, the city of Somalia. All the witches in Somalia, they would not operate. There was no operation. Their powers became powerless and they started looking who is this that has stopped the operation. It was Philip who stopped the operation. Therefore, because the word of God has said, they shall not find among you practice charmers and spells and incarnation and ritual. Because they do that, now you have the authority of Jesus Christ and Jesus will destroy them in the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, you command them to dispatch you command the chamas to depart, to depart the demons assigned to the chamas to go to the dry and the waterless place in Jesus' name. You command them to go to the dry place and the waterless place. You command them to go to the place where they cannot function, where there is nobody whom, whom they can touch. And they will go to the pit of the of the, the bottomness of the pit and stay there until the judgment of God will fall upon them. In the mighty name of Jesus. Well, remember, God as Jesus Christ has given us authority and the power in the mighty name of Jesus to go throughout the whole world and preach the gospel and heal the sick and cast out demons and cast out witchcraft and wizards in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Lord, I want to thank you, Father. I thank you this hour. I bless your name. I glorify you. I lift your name up. I want to thank you. Oh, Lord, my Father, I give all the glory. You command, you control. Uh, you control, hear the word of God. You are a powerless. You will not exist. You will not exile. You will not function in the life of this person, in my life and the life of my children. You go talk to them because they are alive and they are, they are leading. So you have to, to talk to them and destroy their weapon, destroy their powers in Jesus' name. And you command them to attack them, to attack, uh, you, com you command them, let let attack one another and destroy yourself and consume yourself in Jesus' name. Start attacking each other and consume yourself and destroy yourself in Jesus' name. Those are the prayer, aggressive prayer that you can pray. You don't need to fear. You don't need to fear this charm as a spells and 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 charm as spells and incarnation. You don't have to fear them. You have to stand against them. You rebuke them. Many people are suffering, they are being uh, attacked and victimized because they have no idea. You become a fool, completely a fool. They operate, they, op they, they manipulate you. No one will say any word. 
Philip, until Philip has to go with aggressive prayers. If Philip did not go with a, a very aggressive prayers, uh, this witch could not give, could not, could not, could not leave Samari, Samar, 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 Samaria. Samarias were witch, the whole city, by one person who was so powerful. And, and now they believed him because the people could not say any word. No one was able to, to challenge him. They feared him and they, they know that he is from God. But he was a, a false prophet, a, 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 an, an enemy of God. But the people were convinced that he is a God. He has the power of God. And the power he was having is the power of the devil, the power of the enemy. Hallelujah. Praise be the name of Jesus. Yes, yes, let's look on the book of, of, of Revelation 16, verse 14. The book of Revelation, verse 16, verse 16 to 14, the Bible says, For they are demonic spirits, performing signs, who go abroad to the kings of the world, the whole world, to assemble them for battle of the great day of God Almighty. There are spirits using charmers. There are, there are spirits doing miracles and signs and performing great miracles. They can prophesy. They see you like pepper and they can talk to you and, and prophesy to you. That's what people want. Right now, if I start for, uh, prophesy for the and lying to you, you will see how many people will follow me. But when people, they don't, they don't want the truth. They want this false demonic performance miracles is one they want to be deceived and be 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 be, 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 be witched. they want they want the spirit that that blind them and witch them they don't want the truth they want to be deceived and now these charmers they use them they know the weakness you see they know the weakness and they and they put spells on them and 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 they put charms on them now the, those people they can operate with them and they obey them they can't challenge them nobody will see all of them they are blind they don't see anything they don't see nothing they are they're performing signs and and the wonders they do great things look at that uh, the, 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 the the witch who was in samaria simon how he was doing it was it was very powerful so this demonic spirit demonic spirit performing signs and wonders they perform a lot of signs and wonders the bible is warning us the bible is talking to us i am talking to you be careful be careful be careful they are using charms spells and 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 putting things on their mouth and speaking and talk so people will obey them and follow them people they are very wicked and evil so you 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 when you see things things like this test every spirit command their charmers command their witchcraft command their charms to be the, 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 the to lose their powers in jesus name one time i was in the meeting i went to the meeting to 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 to, to listen the the woman the woman is so powerful is a very powerful woman all over the world she's not she has money to the lot of bunch of thousands and thousands of people follow her ministry when i went there I managed to go straight to the to the front chair where she, she where she was preaching. Now this woman she started preaching God. She started singing and preaching. And then right in the middle she started talking in tongue and she was calling the spirits, the spirit, the dead people, the spirit and he was she was talking with the dead people. She was calling the demon spirit the names of the demons. And the people were shouting, people could not listen, and they didn't know what she was saying. She called, I hear, I recorded her, I, I hear with my own ears the way she was doing. And then I stand, I said, God, my God, I want to practice the power of God and the power of darkness. And now I said, you, you, this woman, I deprogram your power, I lose it. I command the powers that you are using right now, the charmer spells and condition, I deprogram them, I destroy them right now in Jesus' name. That, then the woman, she tried to call her power, she tried, she started crying. And then she pointed at me. She said, there's power here, there's power here, there's power here, there's power. Then she started crying, crying. I made her life so miserable, so hard. She could not be able to perform what she wanted to perform. Until very late from seven o'clock until 11 o'clock she had not been able to preach because i said she's not going to perform when i'm here until i said 
let me go now because she can't and people people started going home so that's when she had to she had to get a breakthrough after i left it there so there is power children of god you don't have to let this wizard and the witches operate their magic and power and you are sitting there as a child of god watching them uh, defiling you witching people and then you say this miracle is a man of god is a performing miracle these are the demonic spirit performing signs and wonders they are there and using charms I was in Africa. I've said this before. There are some churches. I'm not saying that there's not miracles. There's no miracles. I know there's healing through through it. Through it there's miracles and of God and there's the miracles of the devil. There's killing miracles and there's satanic miracles. Now, because the church is like business, people that think how they make money and how to manipulate people using witchcraft. All witches and witchcraft they have done now, they have, they have done their group like church. They call their, their their names is the church. Now they have done the their 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 the, the operation, their their business to to be called church. That we are praying. They are, they are praying for you. And they are which pure witch. My one of my sister can be a witness. She can be witness with me. Some a friend told her that there's a prayer, there's a man of God who pray for people. Let's go to pray for us. When she went there, she found it's a pure witch, a really wizard. And you know these people, they have the Bible because the, the, the Bible tells us they will use my name. They will use my name, but don't believe them. They will say, here I am, there I am, don't believe them. They will use the Bible, the name of Jesus, but Jesus has told us, don't believe them. Don't believe them. Now, as I've said, in Africa, I saw people are paid. There are some young, young, young girls. And, and boys who are paid to perform miracles during the prayer season. Now these women, they are, they are, they are, they are smoking uh, uh, opio uh, uh, weed. They smoke a lot of weed and, and, and marijuana. So now when they come to the meeting, they are, you know people are like that. They are like drunk. They are, like, they, they are useless. Now they, when they brought them, they are waiting until the pastor start praying them. Then these people will come and make noise, crying and fight and do like they are, they are, the demons are coming out. And these are paid people. And then others are jumping with the money with this. Those are nonsense and rubbish. But you will see the fruits, the way the pastor is preaching, the way the pastor is doing. Because there are some things he can't touch. And if he touches, it, it, it would backfire. So he's, he knows how to dodge and, and manipulate people because he's using charms, spells, and incarnation, and rain incarnation into the people. The people, they become all of them blind, and, and they have no idea what they are going to do. Now, there's miracle. I know there's miracles of God. God performed miracles. There's miracles really through miracles. But this, this is the last days. Many people that are using charms and, and spells and, and, and incarnation, they use them. They use to spell to people. It is business. They have done the gospel of Jesus Christ to, to be business. And that's, one, that's how they become rich and wealthy. They, are, they use the circuit. They read because the, you want to hear what 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 is what what is your problem all the time. They prophesy to you. They tell you, and they see. I'm not saying they don't see. They see because the demons have the devil has given them the eyes, and they see you in and out. But you destroy them. Don't let them to do rely on you. As a woman of God or a man of God, test every spirit. Pray that God, if this person is from you. Lord, my father, let your will to be done. If it's using magic and the witchcraft and the wizard, I deprogram their power. Don't fear it will not attack you. Don't fear it is nothing will happen to you. Use the blood of Jesus. Cover yourself with the blood of Jesus. You are genuinely repenting. You are already repentant and you need help. You cannot be deceived because God will, will, God will, will, will be with you. You stand against him and speak to the word. It will be established. In the mighty name of Jesus, try command every chance programmed against your life, return to their sender and destroy them in Jesus' name. Command their chance, their powers to lose their direction, command their powers to become powerless, command their powers to be to lose their direction, command their powers to become the command them to be confused. Start commanding them. Be confused in the name of Jesus. 
you demonic satanic pastor witchcraft false prophet you are a liar i'm standing here with the word of god and i deprogram your powers the wish the powers you are using of the kingdom of darkness i destroy them i bleed the blood of jesus i pray for these people to, to their eyes to be open in jesus name they will run you out of that church the ashes will come and run you and and send you away I, I i like the testimony i'm very happy with that testimony one time one of the pastors he was giving a testimony he went to the church and when he went to this church and he knows that man he performed uh witchcraft uh performance in the church in the in his ministry now if they did a mistake to invite him when he went there the man started calling rabba, 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 and the, and the fake dance you know they speak fake dance they are they copied and they have their language now this man was whoa, 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 ha, whoa, 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 and then this man says rubbish in the name of jesus i destroy you that that satanic dance that fake dance i destroy i i lose you i command you to be confused and be learned and powerless in jesus name and then when the man started praying because other people were, were also man manifested, those charms are manifested to people. People are become like crazy in the church. They like mad people. They were all like mad people. And then this man said, God, you sent me to this church. I want to see your power in this church. In the mighty name of Jesus, I deprogram every witch witchcraft power operating in these people. These people are innocent. They have been witched. Therefore, I destroy you. I destroy your power. I deprogram every power operating here. You charmers, I command you to be destroyed. I set you fire. You spells, I command you to die. You, are, you have no power in Jesus' name. And then he, he said, you charmers, today is your hand. Your time has come up. I destroy you. And then this man, he was not able to operate. He tried, he tried. He became powerless. He was so tired. He started yawning, yawning, yawning. And then he said, today a witch has feasted in this church. That's why we, are, we can't operate. How can a witch feast in the church and you have authority to stop them? This man, he was so powerful. But this man stopped his meeting and he was not able to operate. So he started saying his witch, witch, a witch has entered in the church. And there was no witch. It was the power of Jesus. It was the God of Elijah feasted that church. So when he could not able to do anything, he dismissed the, con the congregation. Because that is how that, that that's how the, everybody was saying what if, if it is a witchcraft why can't you cast the witchcraft if it is if it, if it is this witchcraft stopping the meeting you have power destroy the witchcraft but he was not able to, de, to do anything i'm telling you that there's power of god and there's man of god and women of god they can stop operation of witchcraft in the midst of of, of where they are operating and they can't perform their interest the, that's what the bible says in the name of jesus now you look you see the, the scripture the bible is talking here from the book of of Reve, revelation 16 13 the bible says and i saw coming out of the mouth of the dragon and out of the mouth of the beast and out of the mouth of the false prophet three unclean spirit like flocks three unclean like like flocks these false prophets they use charms they use charmers, they use spells, they use witchcraft. How do you know them? How do you know? Because they are on the world right now. This is the last days. How? Because they don't. They are not written on the face. They are not written on jest. They are not. There is no sign, but to tell you that they are using charms and and the charmers. But you will see their, their 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 fruits. You will see their performance. How they do the the things. It's one you will detect. Because always powers of darkness and powers of the right it does not go together. There are some mistakes they make. They are, they are against the scriptures. They, are, they make a lot of error. They make a lot of uh, evil. And they don't leave holiness. That's one way you will detect them. They don't leave holiness. Holiness, it doesn't know. And they will, they, will, they will focus on prosperity, more on prosperity. They talk more of prosperity than any other gospel. They will talk because they are after money and they will talk so much. And these people, they are, they are, they are, they, are, they don't live in holiness. They can sleep with the whole congregation. They take those young, young, young girls and some of them, they live, they, they have life transferred to them from using these young, young people. They 
Therefore, people of God, you will know their fruits. You are not blind. You are not ignorant. Therefore, the spells, the, the, the charmers and spells, and charmers and charmers, the charms and charmers of witchcraft cannot be located you in Jesus' name. Let them be destroyed and lendered powerless in the mighty name of Jesus. God, my Father, I bleed the blood of Jesus over your people. No one will be deceived. No one will be worked against the charmers and spares in the mighty name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus Christ, Lord, I, I command every fittest and the, and the false prophet operating in the life of these people, anyone using charms and charmers, let them die, die in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. My God and my God, I commit your people into your hand. I lift up your name, God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Every trouble, the enemy that is troubling, troubling you, troubling your family, troubling your children, let them lose their direction and fall down and die in Jesus' name. God Almighty, my Father, I bleed the blood of Jesus over your, your people. You charmers and charms, hear the word of God. You will not perform your, 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 your oppression. You will not perform your oppression. I destroy you. I command you to come out from the people. Come out from the people. Wherever is being attacked, wherever is being attacked by spells and charmers of witchcraft, let it come out. I destroy them. I bind you. Come out where you are hiding. Come out from your body. Come out from your body. Come out from your head. Come out from your chest. In the mighty name of Jesus. Spells, hear the word of God. I am cursing you. Wherever is being affected, have been attacked. In the mighty name of Jesus, I command you to get out. Out in the name of Jesus. I bind you and I curse you in Jesus' name. In the mighty name of Jesus. Father, I want to thank you, God. I bless your name. I give the glory, honor in Jesus' name. I call upon your presence in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord, my Father, I cover this prayer with the precious blood. No one will be attacked because of this prayer. In the mighty name of Jesus, my God, protect your people. In the mighty name of Jesus, God, I want to thank you, Jesus. I give all the glory in the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. Amen. Uh, I want to stop here. I want you to call me. If you have been attacked by charmers and, and charms and spells, call me. I will pray. I will pray for you. I will destroy them. I, I will stand up with you and, and pray with you in Jesus' name. You do not you do not be afraid. I am here to help you. Call me. My number is 905-792-3798. And God will help you in Jesus' name. I want to pray that God will deliver you from any spells and charms. And any witchcraft that has been done against you, in the name of Jesus, I, I pray that God will, will help you in Jesus' name. Go to our website, www.overcomersd.com.